What's happening guys? Welcome back to the channel. We're out here at Santa Luz today and uh, man, it's a beautiful day in the neighborhood again, isn't it? Yeah, it sure is. Love this place. It's our home track. Never get sick of it and uh, <laughs> always enjoy it. And we got a special guest out here with Paris today, so it uh, should be fun. Yeah, we're going to have a good time. Um, we're going to do a little bit different format today. Normally we just do a, a match play uh, for lunch and this and that, but since there's going to be three of us today, we're going to do a game called Dots that I think you guys have seen before on one of the older videos, but Mike's going to walk you through what Dots is, how we're going to keep scoring, all that fun stuff. So uh, you get a point for a number of different things. Uh, so for example, like on a par five, if you reach it in three, closest two gets a point. Uh, birdies gets a, a dot or a point, and then uh, an eagle, an extra point. Um, if you hit one inside the stick, it's called a sticky. You get another dot there. Um, if you make a, a putt outside the, the pin, it's called a pulley. Um, we have sandies. If you get up and down, make a par, uh, it's another dot. And then also a Bin Laden if you go from bunker to bunker, so a fairway bunker to the green side bunker, and an up and down, it's called a Bin Laden. You get an extra dot for, actually, you get two dots. Did we make that one up or did you? No, well, I uh, mean, I, I kind someone... of did bunker to bunker, you know, Bin Laden, why not, right? Yeah. And so that's it's just awesome. another uh, opportunity to make an extra dot, so. And here is Paris. What's up, back guys? and better. <laughs> back and better, I guess that's my, um, you call it my quote. Yeah. <laughs> How's your day going, Paris? Pretty good. I'm excited to be out here. Um, only played Santa Luz once. I think it was a few years ago, but I'm excited to be here and just enjoy the day. And you're playing the white tees today? White, or? Tees. white tees. It's about 6,200, so pretty, That's pretty standard. Good. Yep. All right, guys, and make sure you follow Paris on Instagram. Follow our Instagram. We're doing giveaways on there. And uh, let's get this party started. Yeah, follow me on Instagram. <laughs> nah, you don't need any followers. Come on. Oh, I got like 600. Let's try and get me to 1,000. <laughs> this guy had like 300 like six months ago. He's, yeah, I'm up to like 600 he's, he's and pumped. I don't know something right now. So we're, we're moving along. <laughs> Let's get him to 1,000, folks. <laughs> oh, Hashtag thanks. get him to 1,000. <laughs> gonna hit the speed slot. Oh, 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 I think, oh, you carried it. <laughs> oh, Marco, go ahead and tell them how you hit that one past me. I, just peered, I was hit him so bad on the range, so that was uh, a gift from the gods. <laughs> <laughs> Guys, playing dots today. Never played dots before. I don't know what I'm doing, so hopefully I get some uh, Bin Ladens and some pulleys. Still don't know what that is, but we'll figure it out. Keep it posted. She's got a downhill side hill lie with a three wood. So I hit that one 310. I don't know if you guys can see it. It zoomed in. I don't think so. Marco is like 30 yards past me. He bombed that drive. I know he's going to tell you about it on the next shot. So, oh, oh, <laughs> there we go. P90X right there. All right, so Marco is right there. So he'll tell you all about how he hit that past me. Are you going to go for it here? Or what are you thinking? What are you thinking, Big Hoss? Oh God, 311 is just not far enough. 283, but the pin's in the back. To the front, it's like 250. Just go for just, it. Just watch Paris hit one. I'm gonna go ahead and uh, lay up with a seven iron. All right, he's gonna lay up. All right, Paris is calling me out. I'm gonna go ahead and David Tobbins it with a seven iron. <laughs> oh. Right down the middle. Just fine, a little, little flirty with the water, but that's all right. That's why you hit a seven iron. That's right. Got 252 yards of the pin, but the pin's in the back, so it's really like, I just need to get it about 230 up there. And uh, I'm gonna go for it. How got far did you hit bunt. that drive? A little, little bunt, 324. <laughs> <laughs> Perfect. Look at those beautiful clouds. Oh, 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 Mike's gonna oh. show you how not to lay up. All right, so I'm, he's safe with the seven iron. Just gonna have a little side hill of a stance. 
and uh, I'm guessing he's got like 60, 70 yards. 91. Maybe, maybe 91. We gonna hit lob wedge? Yeah, 60 degrees all day. Oh. All right, he missed it to the right, and there's a little ridge there, so it probably went down the hill. He's probably got about 30 feet. Paris just took a drop. She went in the water, unfortunately, so <laughs> she's basically drawing a line of where she went in and uh, giving herself a, a good angle here and a nice flat lie. Guys, look at how pro she is. My wedges <laughs> definitely don't look like that. <laughs> Put it in the bunker. Yep. Green speed's 11 today. This house just got finished. It's huge. Looks like a total monster. All right, we got Paris getting out of the bunker. She just needs a chunk and run this thing out. Okay, about six, seven feet, pretty good. All right, Marco's in the same bunker, just a little bit closer. I caught that little thing. Now Marco's got a touchy little chip coming down the hill. Got away with it though. Away with it. All right, what are we making the dots worth? A buck a piece? Yeah, a buck a piece. All right. Does that, does that work? <laughs> free? <laughs> free well, only if you out. win, they're worth a buck if you lose. <laughs> All right, we're on hole two. It's a par four, it's 442 yards. There's a split fairway right there. So um, if you hit it really far, you can kind of go to the left if you want, but it's kind of a risk versus reward type of play. As you guys can see, there's bunkers and hazard all along the middle. So we're just going to aim out to the middle, uh, right side, and uh, play it down that way. Right side, catch the hill. It did, it got a good bounce. Started down the middle with the draw. It's turning pretty hard to the left. And I can't really tell. Where did that end up? Fairway? Bunker. Bunker? Okay. Started it pretty much right down the middle, and it's staying there. Should be should be perfect. All right, guys, here's where I ended up. Uh, I just missed it a little bit over here to the right, and they have a good angle into the screen. You can see the pin; it's front pin position, and you got to pretty much carry it all the way there because there's a there's a little hazard that is in front of it. It's a bunch of grass; you can head out of there, but uh, it's really hard to find your ball, especially coming in high. So, got to hit a good one here. Got 190 yards left. I'm gonna hit a four iron. There's some pretty good wind going this way, and I just want to make sure I get over all the trouble and either on the green or a little bit long and over. So, gotta hit a good one here. Yeah, long left is okay on this shot. All right. Is that her close? Yeah, she just stuck it. Oh, looks like Paris has made a little sticky. Um, I got 149 in the bunker. Ball's a little bit below my feet, so everything's gonna leak to the right. So I'm just gonna hit uh, an eight iron winds into us and uh, I'm gonna aim out to the left and uh, hopefully it breaks back to the right a little bit. Mike went bunker to bunker. All right, Marco says this is a juicy lie. Let's see what he's got. Yeah, okay, let's. He doesn't have a lot of green to work with. He's gonna have to kind of bite this a little bit. Okay, I won't hurt you. Okay, not too bad. It's got about six, seven feet left. All right, you guys can see where Mike's at right there. He's got a nice little uphill lie. I'm gonna go ahead and call this within two feet. Hmm, a little frisky from San Francisco. That is a good 15 feet. Not his best effort. Oh, <laughs>
All right, we got Paris for birdie and a double daughter. Oh, she nice did it. Spot. Good birdie. Thank you. Oh, and to take the lead. Had to get it back. <laughs> back and better. Back and better on the second hole. <laughs> Guys, give Paris a thumbs up for making that putt. Show some love down in the comments. Girl can play. Guys, look at those clouds. Looks freaking awesome out here. This hole's 385 yards, par four. Pretty easy one. The fairway is wide open to the left, but if you miss to the right, there's obviously bunkers. And then further right of that is just garbage, so. You just want to be over to the left. You can hit driver here, you can get aggressive. And looks like it's tucked in the back left. Oh, good swing. Oh, she pumped it down the middle. Good swing, P. All right, so we all have 87 yards. Pretty good drives right there. So we're gonna try and hit a sticky right here for you. Closest two for five? Yes, sir. <laughs> That uh, looked pretty good. Can't quite see it, but it looked good. Okay. Looks like we're in the same spot. I can't quite see it. Looks good. Oh, he spun it though. Oh, he spun it off. <laughs> Oh, five bucks right in my pocket. All right, here's our three shots. Looks like Paris and I are pretty close, and I won that five bucks. And Marco spun his off the green. I don't know how he did that, but the boy's got some sauce. Those look like stickies. I don't know if they're stickies or not. Close. Should we do a measurement? Uh, you guys are out, I think. Oh, oh, oh. Oh. Uh, Am I? You sure? That looks pretty good to me. <laughs> Why don't you go down there and check the bottom of it? All right, let's get a... That's out. Yeah, it's out. Like... Is it? Okay, all right, that's fair. That's out <laughs> by half an inch. All right guys, par four, 445 yards, going straight uphill. We got a little bit of crosswind from right to left, but nothing uh, nothing too serious. You pretty much want to go out that bunker on the right. It's uh, not reachable, it's a good target with this wind. Headed towards the bunker on the left. Bunker on the left with me. Going up the middle with a little baby draw. All right, Marco pushed one into the bunker and it looks like it plugged right there. So he's gonna have to just kind of hack at it just to get it out. To go to the left of the bunker. I don't even think I can fly this bunker. I think that's a good play. So I'm gonna go out that way. All right. You know, advancing at like 20, 30 yards is okay. I did very good. Okay. Yeah, that's all I could do. He's in this little swale right here. All right, so I got 200 yards, got this lip right in front. I'm just gonna hit a six iron and try and get it over the lip and leave myself uh, like a 15 to 20 yard chip shot. What happened there, Mike? Oh, I caught it a little bit thin. My back foot slipped a tiny bit and uh, I caught the top of the lip and it's okay. Got 184 yards. I'm gonna just hit a six iron and lay it up over here. Got some grass. If I would have hit it this distance that way, it would have been in the bunker. <laughs> oh, looks good. It's all over the pin, a little left. Should be good. So I had a 149 and a 156 with the uphill, so I'm gonna go and play a six iron. Right side with a little draw. Looks good. Good shot. All right, so Mike didn't hit a great one out of the bunker, but he left himself in a good position right in the middle. He's got about 90 yards left with a little bit of slope. What are you gonna hit, lob wedge? Yeah, I got 82 yards. 82. I'm just gonna hit a little knockdown uh, 60 degree and uh, hopefully stick it close. Going 
right at it. Should be good. All right guys, so I think that's me right, right down there. Uh, left a little bit short and got this ridge to go over. And then Mike and Paris went just a tiny bit long. You can see Paris by hairball and Mike's over here to the left. But uh, overall, pretty decent shots.